Everyone, hope you're having a great day. So, as I read here in John 18, you'll call it 18. We learn a little bit about what happens with Yeshua when he's getting, he's starting about to get hung on the cross, he, uh, the stake. Then I could, they can't, people came for him. And it starts in verse 11, it says, Then said Yehoshua unto Kepha, Put your sword in the sheath. The cup which my father has given me, shall I not drink it? So Kepha had just unsheathed his sword. He cut a, guy, a man's ear off, one of the soldiers that came to get him. Because you're off. But what's very important about this verse, he says, The cup which my father has given me, shall I not drink it? Now we have all been given a cup by the Father. It is His will for us, what He wants us to do. The cup which He gave Yeshua was to die on the on the stake for our sins so we'd have repentance in the Torah. And it, see, you don't know what your cup is, you don't know what the will of the Father is, but you got to drink the cup, you got to be accepted. Yeshua accepted the will of what Yahuwah wanted for Him, what His Father wanted for Him. And his and maybe you don't know what it could be, but your cup could be like Yeshua. You could save a bunch of people, right? You could save millions of lives and have repentance. But that's what Yehoshua's was. And I, guys, so this is very important that you understand that the will of Yahuwah is, very, is what it needs to happen, right? Yahuwah has a plan for a reason. He doesn't do anything without meaning. Whatever happens after you have a test, you lose an animal. So a family member might die. He's all a test, part of your, part of the will, part of the plan. He has a plan for everything. And you can use that to help other people. Or if you don't accept it and you hate Yahuwah for it, then you are not accepting his will. So guys, his will must be done. And you must drink the cup. You've got to be able to drink the cup. You must be ready to drink his cup that he's giving you guys. So do not fight against Yahuwah's will. Accept Yahuwah's will. Because whatever his will is, it's a plan for you. And he knows what he has planned for you. I hope you guys have a great day. And Shabbat Shalom.